hello everyone and welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be sharing with you how i made this quick and easy okra soup recipe if you like okra soup a lot and you want to know how to make okra soup the way that you're going to enjoy it just take your chill water sit down and enjoy this video you are going to learn one or two so here are my proteins i've gone ahead to cook down my meat that's how i cook my meat all I do is cook it down. And immediately I come back from work, I just try to make sure I prep meat down because I'll be leaving to work any moment from now and I have to make soup for my hobby. There's no soup in the house. So here I have some chicken and some beef tripe. And in this tray, I have some other, I have some other proteins. I have some aquarano. We like to have it in our soup, which is some beef muscle. And then I have some tongue. That is beef tongue. I have some more beef tribe and I have some stock fish. I just cook these things down and just put it in the freezer. I brought this out since yesterday so that it will defrost and yeah, it's still defrosting. I'm going to share this meat into two parts. I'm not going to use this for one pot because I want to make two different types of soup. Okay, so I'm just going to share it and start cooking. Now I'm going to cook okra soup. My husband likes okra soup a lot. So I'll go ahead and make okra soup first. I'll show you how I'm going to make this up. So here's my peppers, onion. I'm going to blend all of this for my okra soup. I have ginger, I have garlic. I'm going to get all of this ready. Blend it down so we can make our soup. I've gone ahead to chop my onion. I'm going to start making this soup. It's a quick soup. We're not going to waste time, okay? Stay tuned and enjoy this. So I'm going to blend my peppers. We are done blending our peppers. So go ahead and clean your fish very nicely. Take out all the bones and add it to your soup. So I have my stock fish. I'm going to add my... I advise you prep all your items already. It makes it easy. Here is my blended peppers. I'm going to go in with my blended peppers. Add. You can add more if you wish to. So in my pepper blend, I added my whey. Go ahead and add your whey into your pepper blend and add everything together. Add oil to your preference. Go in with your crayfish at this point. You need a lot of crayfish. So what I do with my okra is I slice them fresh and I put them in my freezer. This has been in my freezer. All I need to do is just bring it out and make my soup. Mm -hmm. And here is my sliced onion. It's a very quick soup recipe. You just give in the soup a stir so we can add in our okra. You can choose to add your okra. You can choose to add or you can choose not to. So I'm going to go in with my okra. So because I want it to give me a lot of sliminess, I've gone ahead to blend some of the okras. I'll add it in. I want it to give me that, you know, that sliminess. If you do not add it in, it will not draw very well like you want it to draw. So that's why I've gone ahead to add this to it. So go ahead and add this to it. That will make you enjoy your okra. Guys, I went in with a little bit of ogbono. If you care, you can add ogbono. If you care can decide not to add up one I'm going to add Maggie so you can see I haven't added any Maggie seasoning all this while so you don't want to over salt it over you know over put your Maggie so I'm just going to allow it I will taste and see if I have to add salt so it's been cooking for like 10 minutes I'm going to test now and see if the Maggie First, I'll give it a see the sliminess. Yeah, that is how you want it to be. So, if you like your draw soup to draw very well, you can add a little bit of fog burner or blend your okra into it. I like when my okra is very fresh in the soup. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mmm, this is yum. So, guys, let's give it a quick stir. Our soup is ready. Go in with your vegetables. 
I'm going to add more because this is not enough. My husband like a lot of vegetables and I don't have so much. So yeah, add enough vegetable. That is it. Give it a stir and our soup is ready. You guys, look at that. You want it fresh. You want to still see your soup fresh, right? Yeah. This is it for our okra vegetable soup with some little albano in it. I hope you're going to give it a try. Let me know in the comment section if this is one of your favorite. This is popularly known in Nigeria. A very quick soup to go for our Nigerian families. This is a soup idea you can make. It doesn't cost so much, except if you want to add a lot. For little children that are just learning how to swallow, you can use mackerel fish for them or kote fish or croaker fish, but make sure you debone it very well so they don't swallow bone. This is the soup we usually make for our children, especially when we want them to learn how to swallow. Okra soup, okbono soup, you know, all those draw soup we help them to love to swallow. This soup is popularly known in Nigeria, in Africa and people love it a lot it's very cheap to make except if you want to add different type of protein to it and so on that is where you see that it's very expensive but this soup is very easy to make with your crayfish with your vegetable with your okra you have made this soup trust me even without fish you can mix this soup and enjoy it i hope you have loved this video if it's something you're going to try please let me see your comment in the comment section and also try to prep your items that will help you a lot i like to have meat in the house like as i'll use this one i'll prep another one just to make sure i have meat when i want to cook quick 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 like that i have something to make my soup and save myself the stress good team be loving be kind be merciful god loves the merciful heart i love you all so much thank you give it a massive thumbs up ciao ciao see you in my next video